So the first clip we are viewing today was sent in by Jay Lim. Now, before we even play the clip, I just want to point out that his duo just died to a guy named Hydro Spec, and he was telling them to run. So we know they don't have comms. They're not chilling in a Discord together. So they're just playing probably a duo that he found lurking around. So let's see what happens. Right off the bat, he is, this is the Ash Bridge right here. He is camping behind the Ash Bridge rock. We got a guy over here on the top of the bridge. And if you look very closely, if I just rewind it, we got a guy lurking right over here underneath the bridge. So that's two people that we've seen so far and he's lurking. They don't know where he's at exactly, but they do have a feeling that there's someone there. And then there's going to be a third person coming up top. So he's in a 1v3 situation. So let's see what he can pull off. <laughs> All right, so the first thing I wouldn't have done is to run in the wide open with no cover. When you got two other people to your left, that is the worst idea you can do. But I, but I guess it works. I don't know. Let's see. So he kills this guy, he kills server ID too, but this guy on the bridge whiffs all of his shots. And if I was this guy's duo, I would be so upset. I'm going to play, he goes in, he hides behind a tree and he starts healing up immediately. Now this is something that's really important is staying healthy during a fight like this. So this guy over here shoots his entire clip, only hits one bullet, doesn't realize that trees are completely bulletproof in this game. He tries his best, but he only gets one bullet off. This guy over here, he's pushing. He's smart. He was the guy that was in the water. So for him to be able to push this far, he's a Troom T player. All right, so he gets the heal off, 75 health, and then he immediately turns on this guy. He's got like 10 bullets left, and he gets so lucky with that last bullet to finish off. Guys, this 1v3 right here has relied on so much luck so far. It's insane. And we got this last guy, he's pushing up. For some reason, his inventory is the worst looking inventory, even, even worse than mine sometimes. So he kills that guy. Let's look at this guy's inventory real quick. Let's see, let's see what he's rocking. I gotta get better at this. Um. All right, let's look what he's rocking. So he kills this guy and he's gonna open up the inventory. One second, right there, look. All right, so he's still got his snub nose mags, even though he got rid of his snub nose. He's carrying an MP5 and an L9. And his HUD display is apparently so big, he's got to scroll to get through his inventory. That's insane to me. He's got to be playing on a laptop or something. This guy's just goaded. <laughs> okay. So he pulls it out, and then he gets the last kill, as you guys saw on this guy right here with the MP5 right there. He kills him, that guy, leaving him on about three health. So all luck, a lot of skill too. He be, he clutched it up, you gotta give it to him. So this next video is from two well-known content creators. Well, one well-known content creator, he's duoing with Amaraz, but the boy King Zay, he sent this clip in and he prefaced it, apologizing for the audio and he has the absolute right to apologize because look how god awful this, i don't know what he's doing he's staring at a tree he's looking forward i'm assuming he's looking over there and i get sorry for the quality these guys just send me these terrible quality clips just kidding king's a i'm sure it's not your fault but i'm gonna go ahead and click play so he hears what we heard for the past 10 seconds he turns around and somehow the closer the ambulance gets, the quieter it sounds. That blows my mind, but he's going to jump, get out of the way. They're going to crash into the tree because they had one plan and one plan only. And that was to splatter this guy. No backup plan, no plan B. They had one goal and it was to splatter him and they failed. So let's see what happens next. All right. So <laughs> this guy gets out. And if you scroll back a little bit, Look at this, he was able to get one, two, three, four, five, maybe six shots, 10 shots before he even gets to fire his gun. So I don't know, he couldn't find the trigger. This guy jumps around the thing and he made a big mistake because if you can see here, he decided to bring a shotgun to a close range battle. And that is the worst thing you can possibly do in this game is to even equip a shotgun. So I'm not gonna say any more on that, 
but this guy was obviously going to die from the very beginning because he had a shotgun. There's no way you survive, especially against a guy with an MP5K. So he pulls off the double kill. Holy shit. He hits the holy shit, and then he hits the record. Coming up next, we got J Lim again, and it looks like he found himself some more friends because he is rolling five deep. Now, these are the worst type of people you can come across in this game because no matter what you do against a group of five people, 99% of the time, unless you are extremely lucky or a god at this game, you're gonna lose because look at these guys' loot. These guys got saws, AKMs, AUGs, filtered SK AKSs. This guy has got an AUG. So, Right off the bat, <laughs> unless you put face another 5v5, they're probably going to get a good a good kill. So <laughs> so this poor fella right here, he sees this fire truck. And now typically when I see a fire truck, I'm like, ooh, easy kill. But it's a different story when five people hop out and just start unloading on you. So this guy gets a kill and then they start pushing. And right off the bat, all four people go to loot the same body because they're all so greedy for ammo that they think this poor guy is gonna have any ammo for anybody. And then this guy right here in the magenta bag is getting a nice tea bag in. So <laughs> that's that right there. The only smart person right here is Absolute Luke Go Goblin, Jay Lim, because he knows that there's probably people on this peak right here because this Ashland peak, this Ashland bridge peak is very, very, yeah, look right there. That guy gets a little pop shot. Unfortunately, misses all of his shots which is a huge mistake. You gotta hit those shots if you wanna make it. So we're gonna go ahead and click play. He starts healing up. So one of his teammates dies. So now it's, <laughs> at least one is down. So that guy made a big mistake. He lost the saw. This guy's trying to get up on here. Ooh, if he gets up on here, that's gonna be a bad play because there's no cover. There's no cover. This guy has a really good advantage. So there's two people right there. Okay, he's gonna try to do that. And then he's gonna completely whiff and he's going to live by the grace of God. This guy should have died two times already. But no, these guys' aim is as bad as mine. So he's healing up again, got enough heals. These guys are pretty much at a stalemate. Okay, so he's gonna get that kill. That's a pretty, actually no, his friend got that kill but he helped him out a lot. So they took out Swift. He's actually gonna push. He's pretty brave for pushing. Now it's a, okay. <laughs> so... <laughs> oh my God, that is the funniest thing I've seen. <laughs> His teammate decided to go all the way back, get the fire truck and just said, screw it. This is, this is how we're gonna win the game. This is how we're gonna win the battle. We are just gonna splatter this guy. This guy had no idea what was coming. <laughs> And he just oh, yeah. splattered him. Oh, Next clip is sent in by Stalin says Gulag time. Very nice name. He has got the fully kitted out kit right there. He's got what is that? A FAL. Let's go ahead and see what it is. Yeah, it looks like a fall. He's got a snake smack. So it looks like he's gonna hop on the ladder here. One of his teammates got a kill. He's gonna kill the guy in the red gilly. Immediately go look at that guy. And I if you look at go. that, if you if you don't miss it, all three of them killed what five people? Yeah, they killed they killed four people I all in the quarter, go. all in the course of like Bro, it was a third. ten seconds. Yeah. So good for them. Very nice. XD is awesome, or XD so we some. <laughs> All right, I'm just joking. So he's he's in a he's in a zerg. Looks like they're all kind of struggling. Actually, no, they got pretty good. Except this guy, he just died. But he's got a saw. He's chilling. He sees a car, and they hop out immediately. Now, guys, when you see a car, the best thing to do is hop out immediately because you're gonna have the immediate advantage, especially when these guys don't see you. And it's gonna start unloading. So these guys did in the truck. These guys did the best thing they could do is they put armor and glass on their car. That's gonna save them, at least for the time being, until they can get into cover. He's gonna end up getting one kill. He's gonna kill that guy. And then he thinks he's done. Nope, one guy's gonna come out. And by the grace of God, look at this. Look at this. Triple headshot right here. 26, 26, 26. Triple, I think that's a triple headshot. I think red is headshot, correct me if I'm, if I'm wrong. But he got so lucky, he's one hit. He's gonna go up and heal up, and his friend is gonna clean it up.
Do you want your AR2 clips showcased in a community highlights video? Click the link in the description below to submit your best clips for a chance to be featured. We got another clip being sent in by Jay Lim. This guy is clipping it up. Guys, send me your clips if you want them to be highlighted in this community highlight video. So right off the bat, these guys are chilling in the gun store. It looks like they're just shopping to me. They don't hear what the four people outside just lurking around. This guy's looting a zombie. This guy's at the front desk waiting to be served. And there's another guy, if you see over here at the gun range, shooting targets. <laughs> so that guy's gonna die right there. That guy in the ghillie suit has a clown nose on immediately right off the bat. Big mistake. So these guys are gonna start pushing from the other side. These guys inside don't stand a chance. They already took one out and this poor fella right here. <laughs> okay, so there's actually a fourth person. This was actually four people in here. Then they killed the no skin and then this ghillie skin has one goal in the mind. His goal is to just take one person with him. When you are in this situation, the most damage you can do, the better off you are. Let's see if you can pull it off. Wow, that's actually interesting. Look how good Jay Lim is to understand that he needs to get cover. The Gilly has a good weapon and he's actually gonna take cover even though he has the advantage because if he hadn't, he could have died and then it would have been an unfortunate loss with all that loot waiting for you. They take him out and then they do the unthinkable. They start teabagging them. <laughs> all right, so this next clip again is sent in by xd is awesome and he said he killed a zerg but he is also in a zerg so i wouldn't count that as killing a zerg this seems like a fair fight this seems like a casual game of search and destroy to me and he's he looks like he's coming up from behind them so this guy's Chilling on the corner, unfortunate, terrible way to die. We got a guy to the left over here. We got a guy to the right. So I don't know how this guy ended up behind all of his teammates and behind the enemy team, but it worked out. He's gonna kill that guy, pretty good, not bad. He's gonna look for the other guy, so he saw him. Now he's gonna run up here, take this cover. He's gonna hold that peak. His friends are over here tweaking. They're very lost, it seems like. This guy has no idea what he's doing. He's going to reload the mag. 50 bullets isn't going to cut it for the next battle. He's going to get a nice triple headshot. He takes out the guys. He gets the kills. And they win it for the biscuit. So I hope you guys enjoyed that style and format of a video. I do plan on making these better and higher quality. I just kind of wanted to see what it would look like in this format. So I don't know if I want to be too critical with these or if I want to provide feedback or I just want to react to them. Um, I am going to try to do more blind reacting to videos, but I am in the process of getting my Discord set up. So if you guys do want to send in your videos, make sure to join my Discord or click the link in the description and then submit me your videos. Make sure that they're really good videos. I want to be able to provide some really good content to the viewers. Um, but yeah, guys, give me your feedback. Let me know what you think about this style of video. And I'll plan to upload maybe one of these a week. So enjoy, guys. I'm glad you guys enjoyed. And peace.